Pass up the Jeep, it's good to be free. Load up the pans and fishing poles. The highway is long, the wheels turning round. Pack up the cook stove and the bowls. Arlo and I, we hit the open road. Arlo and I are on the road. Hey everybody, this is just going to be a quick little video. Um, I, it's, uh, well, let's see, end of May, almost uh, June, and all of the ironwood trees out here in the desert are just a beautiful uh, pink purple color. And I wanted to gather a few of these so I can make some sun tea. Now when I see blossoms out in the desert, I always think, ah, sun tea. So I'm going to gather uh, some of these uh, uh, ironwood blossoms and put them in a, a jar right here. And then we'll add some uh, fresh water to it and make some sun tea. Um, should be nice and sweet. Now the ironwood tree is from the uh, pea family. So the uh, little uh, purple flowers here uh, look just like pea blossoms. So uh, I'll show you what those look like. Look at that. Look at those uh, pretty little flowers there. But this whole tree here is just completely covered uh, with purple blossoms. Now the rest of the year uh, the ironwood trees are a pretty tree um, but they tend to look a little bit scraggly. Um, but this time of year when they're covered with these uh, purple flowers um, they're just one of the most striking and pretty uh, trees out here in the desert. Pretty purple blossoms. Mm. Mm, and they smell nice too. And if you were to uh, take a little bit and chew on them, they definitely have a real sweetness to them. So this is definitely going to make a nice uh, sun tea. Look at all those pretty blossoms. Now there are a lot of insects and birds that rely on this tree and uh, you can see um, so many flowers um, with this uh, sweet nectar. Um, they're very attractive. There's even a, uh, a uh, specific bat um, that uh, frequents this tree. All right, that's it. I've got a nice uh, jar here full of these really pretty uh, ironwood tree blossoms. And we're just gonna put some uh, 
water on here. We're going to let it sit in the sun, and it's going to make this uh, really nice, uh, light, sweet uh, ironwood blossom tea. All right, so now I'm back at the house with my ironwood blossoms. Now it's actually the next day, and I took the time to pick the little blossoms off of all the little stems, um, and I, I didn't do all of them, but I did enough to fill up about a third of this jar. To this jar, I'm going to add a couple of green uh, tea bags. That, because I really like the flavor of the blossom scented green tea. You know, similar to a jasmine tea. And I have some filtered water, which I'm going to to uh, put this up here. And then we have our blossoms and our green tea here. And I'm just going to put this in the sun uh, for a couple of hours um, and just make a nice uh, ironwood blossom and green tea sun tea. All right, so I had our ironwood blossoms and green tea, sun tea, um, brewing in the sun uh, for a couple hours. And I put it through a coffee filter and we have a nice uh, clear uh, tea at this point. Um, now it is uh, important to put it through uh, a coffee filter um, because you get all the little uh, bits and pieces out of there. Um, but let's give it a try. It smells like green tea. It also has a little sort of a vegetal aroma to it. Mm, let's give it a try. Well, it has a pretty color, um, say partially because of the green tea. Mm, all right. Definitely has a um, the flavor of the green tea, um, but it also has a like I said a light uh, vegetal uh, uh, flavor, just like it smells. But it is uh, very floral. Mm. Actually, that tastes really nice. Now I was very careful to pick all the little blossoms off of the stems. So we really had just blossoms and tea in here. Now I've done this before and uh, it had some, a little bit more of the stems and things in it and it had a really pronounced green bean type flavor to it. Um, this one doesn't have that at all. Um, well, very light sort of vegetal flavor, but uh, in this case, um, it's a lot more uh, floral. I like that a lot. Now, uh, I think a little bit of lemon and a little bit of honey would make this perfect. Mm. Yeah, it tastes pretty good. Uh, definitely um, a little bit different than your normal tea. Mm. So, there you have it. Um, ironwood, blossom, and green tea, sun tea. Hmm. Pretty good. <laughs> All right. Um, if you like this video, please like, uh, please subscribe. That always helps us a lot. And we'll see you in the next one. All right. Bye bye. Gas up the cheek. It's fun to be free. Load up the pans and fish and poles. Arlo and I, we hit the open road. Oh, he does have a nice color to it. Mm. Mm.
think a little bit of honey will make all the difference in the world. Mm.